Hello and welcome. Today we are going to go through a guided meditation that will help calm your nervous system and support anxiety recovery. One quick disclaimer is that meditation should not be used as a coping mechanism or as an action to take the anxiety away. I have linked a free download to the ideal response in the description. This meditation is meant to develop your mindset and practice acceptance during your recovery journey in tandem with the proper response. This meditation is meant to develop your mindset and practice acceptance during your recovery journey in tandem with the proper response. Now let's get started. Sit in a comfortable, upright, seated position to promote alertness. You can rest your hands on your knees or legs or whatever feels comfortable. Now bring your attention to your breath. To help bring you into a calm state, you will want to breathe from your diaphragm. To do this, you can place one hand on your stomach and you should feel it rising as you inhale and falling as you exhale. Try this for a few breaths. And as we do this, we are activating our parasympathetic nervous system. While we do, let's practice gratitude and think how incredible it is that we have air to fill our lungs. God gives us each breath and sustains our life because our time on earth is still in his plan and you still have purpose here. As we practice gratitude, we can stabilize our mood and recalibrate our perspective by shifting focus away from how we feel. We are all in a spiritual battle, fighting to see or not see the goodness of God. We can shift focus away from what we think God is not doing and rather trust that he has a plan. Now take two minutes to practice gratitude and acceptance of where things are at in your life in this exact moment without any judgment or pressure. Now let's shift back to the breath. We are going to add fixed ratio breath to our diaphragmatic breathing. We will start with four in and six out. So we will inhale first in two, three, four, and out two, three, four, five, six. In two, three, four, and out 
two, three, four, and out two, three, four, five, six. In two, three, four, and out two, three, four, five, six. Keep going now with this ratio and keep breathing from your diaphragm. We're going to do this for a few minutes. And as thoughts come into your mind, let them slowly pass without judgment and put the focus back on your breath. Don't push these thoughts away. Rather, we will work on not engaging with them and just picturing them as clouds that are slowly moving in the distance as you come back to your breath. In, two, three, four. Out, two, three, four, five, six. Now on your own again for three minutes. As thoughts pop up, just acknowledge them and then guide your focus back to your breath. Now we will transition out of the breath focus and we will go through some affirmations. Continue to stay in a comfortable and alert seated position with your eyes either opened or closed. Repeat after me, either out loud or in your head. My nervous system is sensitized and that is creating physical and emotional symptoms. As I continue to practice the proper response, I will show my body that it no longer needs to protect me by sending adrenaline and other stress hormones because there is no threat. This will take time and consistency to retrain my brain with neuroplasticity by replacing old thought patterns and unproductive habits. This healing journey is going to teach me so much and I will grow into a much stronger and more resilient person. God could heal me and take this away today if that's his plan, but he might be giving me a chance to grow and transform my mind into a healthier version. This journey can take as long as it needs and I will not rush it. There is nothing that I need to do or fix. Exodus 14, 14. God will fight for you. You need only to be still. I will not fear my symptoms. My doctors have told me that I am not in danger, and I know that all of these symptoms have one cause, and that is nervous system sensitization. Proper response and time will lead me to full recovery. This sensitization is caused by stress hormones, including adrenaline that can trigger a physiological response in nearly every part of the body. This is my body's alarm system, and it is only trying to protect me. 2 Timothy 2.11 God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of sound mind. I will trust that God is taking care of me and I don't need to take this burden on alone. God is in control and I am not. I will bring the pressure away from myself and bring my focus outwards on life again. Jeremiah 29 11, for I know the plans I have for you, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope for the future. I will stop looking for all of the quick fix cures that offer no remedy and trust that my body will desensitize through response and neuroplasticity because that's the way God made it to function. I will ask God for true peace as I go through this recovery journey that I have not found in anything else. John 14, 27, peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. I do not give to you as the world does. Do not let your hearts be troubled and do not be afraid. Thank you for joining us today in this meditation. And we hope that it is helpful to you. Put this into practice daily when you wake up and right before bed. Also, be sure to download the ideal response in the description link.
That is the ultimate practical desensitization and recovery tool. Have a great day, and we will be praying for you during your journey.